Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create your own portfolio website with a custom domain name with your name on it. And I'll try to do it in about five minutes. I think as an artist trying to get noticed, it's really important to have your own personal portfolio sites. I know a lot of people use um, web 2.0 websites such as Wix or other sites that let you create a website for free. But then the URL for the name site, the domain name is not your actual name. It's always like Wix dot or something dot Wix. I don't know. And I think it, it looks less professional than, than having your own domain name. I have one at mormoros.com and there I, sh I, pr I show my demo reel, some info about me, uh, past work. So I do think it's really important, but I know a lot of people are kind of scared of the process of creating your own website. It does look a little complicated. You might think you need to code HTML, Java, but really today it's just so easy to do it without any experience in programming, website design. Everything is super easy to use and I'll show you how. First, you got to pick a hosting service. You can use whatever one you want. I recommend using Bluehost. I have a little banner here on my site and if you click on it, I will get a small commission. It's not going to cost anything more to you. This is the one, this is the hosting service I use to run both this site and my personal website. So let's see, you just press that banner and let's get started. All right, so you want to pick your domain name. Uh, you want to use your name, I guess, preferably if this is a personal portfolio site. For this video, I'm just going to create mycoolportfolio.com. And it's going to let you know if it's available. If it's not available, if your name is already taken, try adding the word portfolio at the end or something. Try, try being creative, but sticking to your own name. I think that's, that's pretty important. All right, it seems like mycoolportfolio is available. Dot com. All right, I'm going to put some information here. I'm blacking it out. I'm sorry. You can select the package. Uh, it's going to be cheaper if you go for 36 months. Uh, but if you don't want to commit yet, I guess 695 is not that much too. So you can choose one year subscription. I wouldn't I wouldn't take any of those packages. That's just a lot of money paying for stuff you don't even know. So just skip it. I'm putting some credit card information. They're going to offer you some more options that I wouldn't recommend taking any of them. Just press complete. And that's it. I have a website. Look how easy it was. It took me two seconds and the domain name mycoolportfolio.com is now mine. I'm going to create a password. And now I'm going to log in. Using that password. All right, the control panel is going to take a little while to load. All right, so the control panel has finished loading. We're going to go to home and press install WordPress. That's the first thing you want to do. I'm going to press start. All right, after WordPress has been installed, we can just go to our website, michaelportfolio.com. It's gonna show you the default template for, the, for WordPress. We're gonna log in. All right, and you get some templates for free if you go to Appearances, Themes, you can choose any of the free WordPress themes that come with WordPress. Right now, uh, 2014 is active, which is, it's pretty nice. We're not gonna get into customizing it too much, but I am going to show you how to create a demo reel video that's gonna be on your homepage. So let's do that now. 
I'm going to go into posts and I'm just going to create a new post. I'm going to delete that default one. Create a new one. Call it a demo reel. And I'm going to go to Vimeo and get my own demo reel so I can just to show you. You just copy the link, paste it, press publish. Now let's go again to the website. Look at that. The post is on the front page called My Demo Reel. People can press play. That's it. You asked for it. So you have your own website that looks pretty cool. You can customize it to look much better. Or you can go to my best WordPress portfolio theme article that we have on our website and get one of the premium themes that cost money. But you get a much nicer look for your site. So uh, feel free to play around with it and have fun. Thanks for watching.